are a complete idiot. How was I supposed to know she told the police? You shouldn't have let her make you lie, not over something like that. You could be prosecuted now for withholding evidence. Oh, don't be so dramatic. I told him everything I mm, know. A week late. Sometimes I wonder if you've got the brains you were born with. ta -da. That concludes the floor show for this morning. Can I help you? What was all that about? Uh, on the surface, you'd think it was about me not reporting Lily's mugging. But truth be known, it's more about her Tony not getting in touch. You know, you can't keep hiding every time a copper goes by. She wasn't just walking by, she was grilling Terry. Yeah, about mugging you, mug. Don't just worry about the gig tonight. And just let the rest of the world go by, eh? I'll see you later. Yeah. Huh. Now, they're saying I thought I'd never see. What? Two women fighting over Barry Evans. You're joking. No, Lenny told me. So, how many are fighting over you at the moment? Why do you want to know? Well, if you haven't got a bevy of beauties going with you tonight, you might want to think about taking me. I thought you were coming with Robbie. Well, I don't have to if you get me in for nothing. All right, you can help me set up if you want a freebie. Great. Stay here. Mm -hmm. Coffee to go. Oh, you all right? Women trouble, mate. Lucky you. Why does everyone keep telling me that? Robbie. I've got some good news for you. You're off the hook for tonight. Bertie's getting me in for nothing. What about me? Well, don't get me wrong, but I don't think you're his type. I meant he should be paying for me. I'm the one that put the flyers out. Well, at least you're saving money on me. So, you want a freebie tonight then, Teresa? Um, yeah, it's not a problem, is it? No, not at all. Excellent. You can come in on the guest list if you want to be. Can I? Oh, thanks. Can I bring somebody? You started something now. All depends on what sort of discount I get on the coffee. On the house, of course. Done. I think you just have been. Yeah, thanks for asking me about my love life, but uh, I'm trying to keep things a bit low-key at the moment, you know what I mean? What, so Natalie won't have a go at you? Uh, something like that, yeah. Well, if it's a Barry Evans, well, for Dante to Casanova. <laughs> You're all very generous to you today. Yeah, I'm just pleased to see Matt taking an interest in girls. Yeah, what I want to know is why. <laughs> you are so suspicious, you know that. He's had a rough time lately. He's got no parents around, so I'm just keeping an eye on him. Besides, the full house tonight won't do either of us any harm. Oh, I see. And you're so worried about your bombing, you've got to pay for the house. His freebies? Listen, uh, things are on the up, so I can afford to be a little bit magnanimous. In fact, um, I'm even ready to step in and save your business, if you like. Well, I don't see why not. I saved your sex life. <laughs> Talking of freebies, how'd you fancy one tonight? <laughs> now, there is an offer to turn a girl's head. For intro. Nothing in this life's free, Steve. You should know that. Do you want to come or not? Yeah, why not? I fancy a celebration. Oh, yeah, why? Oh, didn't I tell you? Discounts are working for me and all. I've got all my finance in place for my gym. Yeah, all right. I look forward to seeing you later. All right, mate, nice one. I reckon we're going to have a good night tonight, Matt. Steve, delivery needs signing Yeah, all right, I'm just coming. Keep an eye on things for me, will you? No problem, boss. Oh, and uh, good to see you back, Mac. Steve, your phone. Hello? Hello? Claudia? No, Steve's not here at the minute. Can I take a message? Okay. Bye. See you later. Matt? I thought you was her. What are you talking about? I thought it was her on your mobile. It sounded just like her. Saskia. Of course it's not Saskia. Now we talked about this, haven't we? I know, I know, it was Claudia. And? You didn't leave a message. Every time I think I've got a grip on it, something comes and ruins it. Well then you've got to pick yourself up and move on. Only you can do it, Matt. Now listen to me. You're just on your way to being a very successful DJ in an East End club. And tonight, tonight's going to be your big night. Come on in. I'll make sure one of the specials. 
soin. Nobody else touches them but me. You okay? Yeah, great. Want a drink? No, thanks. Listen, Robbie, I wanted to say something. Yeah? Um, well, it's been great fun these last couple of days, yeah? Yeah, sure. But I just want us to be mates. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, sure. Never thought it was anything else. Oh, right. Um, I just need to tell you, that's all. This is cool. I'm just glad you decided to come tonight, yeah? Oh, good. Right, shall I get the drinks in then, yeah? Yeah, yeah, go on. You're distracting me from my job. Do you mind? No, it depends. On what? On what you're up to. Because last time we were together, we hardly made music, did we? So what's brought this on? Hormones. What? Oi, Cupid. See your arrows struck over then. Yeah, good, eh? Well, let's hope it leads to a deeper, meaningful relationship. What, a bit like ours? In your dreams. So what, is it just sex then? 